morning, Monarchs. I'm Anna. And I'm Shannon. And welcome to this week's edition of Monarch, Monarch News. News. Remember, Monarchs, AP payments are due March 9th in the Finance Office. Spring Fling is March 23rd at SDSU Montezuma Hall from 7 p.m. to 11 p.m. Tickets cost $20 with an ASB card and $25 without. Monarchs, we have an upcoming Spirit Assembly and Spirit Week. These are the Spirit Days to get ready. Monday is Meme Day. Tuesday is Vacation Day. Wednesday, Flower Power. Thursday, Tropical Tie-Dye Day. Friday is White Out! Good morning, Monarchs. I'm Mariah, here with Blake Schmidt, our star competitor for Monta Vista's wrestling team. Tell us about your season, Blake. We had a pretty good season as a uh, team. We, we won league this year, so yeah, just in their condition every day. What's your favorite thing about wrestling? Uh, I get to whip people's butts. Congratulations for qualifying for the state championship. Yay! Good morning, Monarchs. This is Minharis here. Monarchs, we want to make sure that you are aware of our school going through a WASC accreditation process and having a visiting committee coming on site March 11th through the 14th. So I thought I'd spend a little bit of time telling you what WASC is, and so you are aware when you see the visitors on our campus. As part of the WASC self-study process, we review our school's mission, vision, and student learning outcomes. And what we have done over the past year and a half is we have met with different stakeholders, students, groups, and to get their feedback on revising our mission statement, our vision statement, and most importantly, the student learning outcomes that we have for all of you here at Monta Vista. Please be aware that we now have these wonderful posters that will be placed in your classrooms and that please feel free to ask your teachers about this process, but we want you all to become familiar with those student learning outcomes. And as you can see, they're all related to what we hope you will all achieve by the time you leave Monta Vista. So Monarchs, we just want to remind you that when our visiting committee is here for the WASC visit in March, that you continue to be the wonderful students that you are. Be, say hello to them uh, when they're in classrooms, please, and you're welcome to engage them in conversation if they want to touch base with you. But just remember that we are representing Monta Vista as the best we can. So if you have any questions about the WASC process, please ask your teachers. They've been a part of it, any staff members, and any of the administrators and we'd be welcome to talk to you about that. So uh, we're looking forward to their visit and looking forward to having you participate in this important process. Thank you. Good morning Monarchs. I want to touch base with you regarding school safety. Um, as you know, uh, last week there was an incident in Florida that occurred that raised a lot of concerns across the country. Uh, one of the things we want to make sure that you're aware of is our um, alarms and our drills that we typically do. Right now, as you know, we have our fire alarms uh, that are set to go off in case of an emergency and we have practiced our drills. Um, we want to make sure that you know that we are looked at our policy with regard to fire alarms. And what we're going to be doing at this point is if a fire alarm does go off, we have asked for students to stay in their classrooms as we assess where the alarm was pulled and be able to determine the, uh, the situation right away and inform your teacher and your office whether or not you need to evacuate. So please make sure uh, that you touch base with your teachers uh, regarding this new protocol and we will keep you informed immediately if a, an alarm sounds on when it is safe to evacuate. Thank you so much for listening to the safety message. If you have any questions at all, please don't hesitate to ask us. Thank you. Good morning. My name is Joe Coda, and I'm the new assistant principal here at Monta Vista High School. I'm really excited to be a part of the Monarch family and look forward to working with each and every one of you. That's it for this week. And remember, stay classy, Monarchs. That was too risky. Good morning, Monarchs. Just a few reminders about assets coming up this week. 
Um, tomorrow, March 1st, in room 811, we have our intramural soccer meeting. You will need to stop by to get a waiver form, which you will need to play intramural soccer. Um, again, that's 1245 in room 811, tomorrow, March 1st. Please stop by, and the first game will be March 9th on the lower field next to the tennis courts. We hope you come out for that. Room 606, today after school, uh, Boba Fest. So I know a lot of you are really into that, so I hope that you stop by for that and enjoy Boba of a tea with us. If you've never had that, it's a great opportunity to go ahead and try what that is. Um, also, crochet. How are you not doing this yet, Monarchs? Um, room 101 on Thursdays from 3 to 4.30 with Miss Ramirez. Please stop by. I mean, the things that I make really only take me a half hour, and I really want to get you to that level, Monarchs, uh, because it is an invaluable skill for the rest of your life. Um, also, Art Roar. I, are you interested in marketing or art or creative or designing for the rest of your life? Uh, you will need a portfolio. Uh, this is a great opportunity to build that portfolio for applying for the jobs that you're going to need for the future. So stop by on Thursdays from 3 to 4 with Miss Preble, a published author herself. Um, culinary Arts is doing some great things, especially uh, in the mornings on Mondays. I see a lot of you around here. Um, so stop by for breakfast from 8 to 9 a.m. in room 606. Um, also, the garden. I want to let you know that I've ordered all of the items for the garden. So you're going to start to see that garden pop up in the back behind the art building. Um, March is the time that you're supposed to start planting your garden. So I'm looking forward to working with you all to get that going. I know a lot of people are very excited about that. So make sure you're checking into assets from two to four on Tuesdays with Mr. Estrella um, to sign in. I mean, keep that garden going. Um, also, just 29 different opportunities for assets. If you do not know about our programs, go to the webpage, uh, the Monta Vista homepage. From there, the student tab, we are number one, assets. Go to that, uh, that tab and then you'll go ahead and find the picture of me to the right, right under that. The 2017-2018 schedule is right there. Click on that and you're gonna learn about the 29 different programs that we have on our campus. I hope you're checking into assets and I'll look forward to meeting with you real soon for another student meeting. Thank you for listening to this and have a great rest of your week.